Megan's sweet family tribute with poignant jewelry choice we are thrilled. Megan's jewelry held a very special meaning. The Duchess of Sussex made a virtual appearance at the Vax Live concert in Los Angeles on Saturday night. Wearing a stunning floral print shirt dress from Carolina Herrera. However, all eyes were on Meghan's accessories, as she sported the late Princess Diana's £17,000 gold Cartier watch. Princess Diana was gifted the watch by her dad for her 21st birthday, and was seen wearing it on multiple occasions. The touching tribute came as Meghan delivered a speech about how women who have been disproportionately impacted by the pandemic. Speaking from her California home, the Duchess said, This year has been defined by communities coming together, tirelessly, and heroically, to tackle pandemic. We've gathered here tonight as the road ahead is getting brighter. But it's going to take every one of us to find our way forward. Meghan further accessorized her look with a Cartier yellow gold love bracelet. And a women power charm necklace, which is available to purchase on all. The former Suits actress continues to advocate strongly for gender equality. And we imagine Meghan may have worn the necklace as a sweet tribute to her baby girl, who is due this summer. If you love Meghan's meaningful necklace as much as we do, we have found some amazing alternatives so that you can recreate the look. While awaiting the birth of their baby girl, Meghan and Prince Harry celebrated their very first US Mother's Day on Sunday with their son, Archie. Although they celebrated in private, the generous mum made a very special gesture in honor of the big day. On Sunday, Local organization Harvest Home LA took to Instagram to share their delight that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's foundation, Archival, was working with Procter & Gamble donating diapers, cleaning supplies, and other essential items to the non-profit, which helps pregnant women and their children. My husband and I are thrilled to soon be welcoming a daughter, the Duchess of Sussex said. Meghan and Prince Harry are thrilled for their baby girl's arrival. On Saturday, the Duchess of Sussex who is expecting the couple's second child, a little sister for two-year-old Archie. This summer made a virtual appearance at the Global Citizens Vax Live, the concert to reunite the world. My husband and I are thrilled to soon be welcoming a daughter, Meghan said. It's a feeling of joy we share with millions of other families around the world. When we think of her, we think of all the young women and girls around the globe who must be given the ability and the support to lead us forward. Their future leadership depends on the decisions we make and the actions we take now to set them up, and set all of us up. For a successful, equitable, compassionate tomorrow, she continued. We want to make sure that as we recover, we recover stronger. That as we rebuild, we rebuild together. For her speech, Meghan wore a powerful piece of jewelry, or inspired women power charm necklace. The gold necklace features a pendant with the symbol for female alongside of a raised fist. Meghan also spoke about how important it is for future generations to be given equal access to the vaccine. We've gathered tonight because the road ahead is getting brighter. But it's going to take every one of us to find our way forward. As campaign chairs of Vax Live, my husband and I believe it's critical that our recovery prioritizes the health, safety and success of everyone, particularly women who have been disproportionately affected by this pandemic, said Meghan. Women and especially women of color, have seen a generation of economic gain wiped out. Since the pandemic began, nearly five and a half million women have lost work in the U.S., and 47 million more women around the world are expected to slip into extreme poverty, she added. Meghan and Prince Harry served as the campaign chairs of the star-studded show, which had a goal to increase donations and sharing of vaccine doses to priority populations around the world. Ahead of the broadcast on Saturday evening, Global Citizen shared a clip of Harry discussing why the campaign is so important to him. Over the last year, everyone has experienced so much loss and so much struggle. And I think the only way that we are really going to heal and recover is to do that together, he said. When, Global Citizen CEO Hugh Evans, asked us to be campaign chairs, of course, we jumped at the opportunity to say yes. To throw our support behind this because we believe in it he continued. But I think what we really need to be aware of and what we cannot allow to happen, is science being politicized. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos, thank you very much.